Hey people, how have you been? It's my hope you're doing great wherever you are. Welcome to yet another episode of Doreen House Teen. And as you all know, in this channel, it's all about positivity and positive vibes. So if it's the first time you're tuning to my channel, please consider subscribing because you're going to love it here. For the returning subscribers, thank you so much for the love and support you've shown me so far. It's you people that give me the energy to keep doing this, so let's keep doing this. So in today's video, I want to share with you an experience. This is a lesson I learned a few days ago and I was like, what? This is worth sharing with people out here because it can happen to anyone and maybe it may help someone out there who may also need to use the same technique. So there is this day that I'm just in my house relaxing and all of a sudden my neighbor comes in rushing and she's like uh, please come to my house and assist me do something so i quickly followed her to a house and on getting into a house she pointed on a burning mekongas so at first i didn't get uh what was wrong with the mekongas so she asked me to help her uh, turn off uh, the knob because uh, for her she had tried and she was not able to. So I went ahead and also tried uh, to turn off the knob so that I can put out the fire, but I was also not able because the knob was kind of a loose. And uh, for a moment, we panicked and we stared to each other and we were like, now what next? What are we supposed to do? So I suggested we take uh, the Mekong gas outside because uh, for it being in the house, I felt it was a bit dangerous. So we gathered our courage and uh, carried the Mekong as outside. And um, once it was outside, we felt more safer. But still, we didn't have a way to put out the fire. So we decided to seek help from another neighbor who is a man. You know, we ladies believe that men have a way of solving such little uh, problems. So he came and uh, he also tried to turn off the knob, but still he was not able to put out the fire. And now we started asking each other, what next? How are we supposed to put out the fire? And you know now this time round, because it's outside, the frames were increasing and we were like, how are we supposed to do it? So the guy suggested we use water to put out the fire and I was like, what? That's a bad idea because um, I felt uh, maybe the water may accelerate the fire more. So at last we agreed to use a blanket. So I rushed into the house, came with a blanket and handed it over to the guy and he used the blanket to blow off the fire and fortunately the fire went out but the gas was still coming out so he decided to remove the burner from the Mekong gas and that's how we were able to put out the fire and for me this was a lesson and I felt uh, I needed to share this with people out here because uh, you never know it may happen to anybody so it's important to have such information or such clues on what to do in such scenarios like us in the beginning we didn't have a clue on how we were supposed to put out the fire actually we were guessing so if you're using a mechon gas and all of a sudden you cannot turn off the knob because the knob is loose then you don't need to panic all you need is to get a blanket and use it to blow off the fire so that was an experience worth sharing so if you love this video don't forget to subscribe like and share with other people so that they can see the video as well see you in the next video bye bye